the COVID-19 vaccine is uh, busy rolling out all over the world and uh, people are against it and some are for it and all have their reasons. Uh, we are waiting here in South Africa, uh, hopefully uh, to get our first uh, roll out next week. But in the meantime, someone, uh, a South African, someone like uh, uh, Marion Erskine is in the United uh, Arab Emirates and he already received uh, two vaccines, uh, if I'm uh, two shots. Uh, Marion, yes. am I right? Yes, Isaac, I received my second dose yesterday. Okay, great. So the reason for this uh, uh, conversation with you is just to get uh, behind the feelings and the experience of it. So uh, let's start uh, a little bit uh, before. Um, uh, how did you feel? You are one of the positive ones about the vaccine. So, so uh, explain to us uh, your feelings and the experience you had. You know what, Isaac, um, many people say you don't know what you put inside your body. And I've joked with them. These are coming from people that eat hot dogs and bologna. But um, I ac absolutely believe that, uh, especially in the United Arab Emirates, they are um, asking us that their sheikhs have taken the vaccine. They've asked uh, the population to, to try and get to herd immunity as soon as possible. I am going to take this chance i've had the back as i said as i said I've, I've taken the second dose already and i absolutely feel 100 percent fine i had nothing weird um people are asking me uh, 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 you know do you feel like you want to write the number 666 on stuff <laughs> do you feel like your 5g is is messing with you nothing bill gates has not contacted me yet um <laughs> And every single one of my friends that have taken the vaccine is absolutely fine. The very first dose after I had that, I had a little bit of almost like hot, cold sweat for, mm. for about two, two days. Like you, you feel like your body's a bit warm and then you feel like your body's a bit cold, but nothing, nothing. Um, I mean, I've had the yellow fever shot and everything that was much worse than this was. So I'm very happy. Marion, did they explain to you the reason for that feeling? Uh, because I believe uh, uh, from uh, some of the people here in South Africa that went for the trials um, mm -hmm. say that they experienced a little bit of a fever. So it, it looks like a general kind of thing. It's, it's absolutely normal. Um, they have told me about that. Um, everybody has different kinds. Of, so, so some of my colleagues that have taken it, has had absolutely nothing, not even a bit of a, a, a feeling that they had a fever. I had a feeling that I was heating up or getting cold, but I was testing my, my own temperature regularly and nothing. There was no fluctuation in my actual body temperature. Mm. So the, um, the clinic told me there you might experience something like that. It's just the virus of the, the vaccine that's starting to work that's starting to, you know, like um, wake up your body to possible attacks and stuff from the virus. But um, no, nothing strange. What type of uh, vaccine did you guys get in uh, UAE? So we have got the Sinopharm um, vac vac vaccine from China. And um, there are two different uh, Chinese vaccines. The one is Sinopharm. Um, in the UAE, we've had about an 88% success rate with, with that so far. Um, it's not the Sinovac that they are using in Brazil that has only about a 50% um, success with Sinopharm banks. Then you went for the second one. I saw the photo on your, on your Facebook page. Yes, um, with... <laughs> I, that was yesterday. So this is about, about 20, 20, 21 days after your first shot, you should go for your, for your second jab. And, and uh, did you experience anything uh, with that uh, jab? absolutely nothing you know what it it uh, i don't know what's the english word for it but it, it felt like somebody just gave me a, gave me a, a like a light lummy mm. you know on the arm like oh, just yeah. like like someone just gave me a slight punch so i'm aware of it but it's not hurting mm. at all it just i know that something went into this arm that's it's just a, an awareness but it's not painful sounds like um uh, vitamin b12 injection yes. can be it, worse than uh, this one 
I've had a vitamin B and it, it is about 10 times worse. I guarantee you that. So I like the vitamin B12 hurts. This one did not hurt. And I'm very scared of needles and, and things like that, by the way. So um, I have to honestly say that there was no issues from my side and not anyone that, that has taken it so far as come to normal, hopefully. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Marion Erskine. He's a South African uh, living and working in the United Arab Emirates at the moment. Thank you uh, for uh, talking to us, Marion. You are very welcome. And my, my last message is, Ian, just let, I want to ask people, don't just listen to everything you read on Facebook and whatever. Mm -hmm. I know there's a lot of conspiracy theories out there. Of course, people are scared, but please don't worry. We are absolutely fine. There's, not, there's, there's been no issues over here. I'm very happy that I got that opportunity and I will, I, I would never, I mean, I, there's no regrets, no regrets whatsoever. Thank you.